The spiritual steal away always goes very deep when we sing it nowadays. It comes, of course, from the body of songs that came from slaves who were uh, held captive and forced into labor and treated so badly. It's one of our horrible things in our history um, as human beings to have done this to, to other human beings. But we sing these spirituals with tremendous respect and awareness of where they came from and the journey that they represent. This one in particular, I think, goes deep because it can have so many meanings for anybody. Um, it's one of the spirituals that did actually, in its original context, have double meaning, where it meant steal away as if to have an appointment with Jesus, to, just to spiritually be with Jesus can give one the strength to endure a horrific times. But it also meant literally to steal away, to escape from the slave owner and um, could be sung as a message to do so, to get out <laughs> and uh, escape. Um, for us today, I see it and I've seen its effect as being steal away from all of the things that make us so darn busy. Um, we can't really let go of that thirst to do more, have more, uh, be busier. And uh, when we sang this hymn and the recording of Hymns We Love to Sing, the leader, who was my wife Susan, took it very slowly. Steal away. Steal away. And I remember sensing the room going, oh, come on, we can't go this slow. Um, and I remember being admonished by a Baptist minister, what is your rush? <laughs> and indeed, by the time we got to the second stanza, the room, the entire space had been transformed to another place. They, we literally got out of our crowded, busy minds and allowed room for peace and tranquility for Jesus, ultimately. It was one of those moments I'll never forget. The arrangement is not really an arrangement. We simply encourage people to make harmonies up, which of course would have been the case in the original context out in the fields, for example, um, as the slaves were working, would improvise harmonies, would improvise responses to each other, improvise all kinds of different forms of singing and um, so the harmonies that we hear are the ones that just naturally erupted in that gathering. It really was magic, and I'm grateful for this song, even as it comes out of a horrible context. <laughs> 